Mesdames et Messieurs, ce que nous allons faire ce soir, nous allons nous Come on, tell me all about your collection, which I love. DJ Kings, please, fix me up. Ok, on va te demander de nous présenter un tout petit peu ta collection aujourd'hui. C'est une magnifique collection et puis on peut apprécier le style et euh, tout le savoir-faire de la textile que vous y mettez. On va vous demander en quelques mots de nous présenter ce magnifique panel. Bonsoir tout le monde. Merci de votre présence euh, et je remercie euh, tout le monde, y compris les mannequins. Merci beaucoup. Et merci à Mousse. Merci beaucoup. Et ma collection, en, en tant qu'Africaine, je voulais mettre euh, les tissus africains en valeur. Et comme on est en Europe, donc je voulais euh, faire le mélange des deux. Donc euh, voilà. Comme on est issu de deux cultures, donc euh, c'est pour ça. Voilà. Mais on garde la signature euh, africaine. Et on remarque aussi. Et on doit remarquer aussi. On va applaudir pour elle. Ne soyez pas timide. On est ensemble ou quoi Voilà. On a remarqué aussi une tendance un tout petit peu euh, juvénile dans vos tenues. Est-ce qu'on peut dire que vous habillez toutes les générations Oui, exactement. J'aimerais bien faire à tout le monde, que ce soit les jeunes, les grands, les enfants. Donc euh, voilà. On va applaudir très fort pour elle, mesdames et messieurs, c'est Brigitte. As you can see, the girls are wearing beautiful jewelry, including myself. Ah, I didn't know that. Yeah, all attention has to be to us, you know. It's wow. all about Africa. So, my darling, Dilo, can I have you up here? As you can see, Bobby, yeah. the girls are wearing the clothes. It's the ethnic Yeah. And as you can also see, the girls are wearing the jewelry. Yeah. So somebody else decided to work along with the ethnic and give it more. Yeah. I'm telling you, those wow. jewelry is handmade. Feel free, just go behind there and buy something. It's very important. So if you need something from all those uh, clothes here, please just go behind there, try to buy some uh, before go home. I just want you to present to us all those joyry joys here today. Thank you. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Margaret Sylvester, the CEO of the Love Jewelry House. All our jewelry is uh, handmade. I designed most of the jewelry you're looking at this evening. And um, they are wonderful from, we use um, gemstone, uh, stones, Sarusky stones, resins, and um, some of the jewelry, we have them in pendants, we have them in mesh, and um, they are um, 18 karat gold plated. Um, they have long-term guarantee on them. Um, as you can see this evening, all the ladies are looking radiant and beautiful, elegant, very stylish, and uh, we do hope that you people will, you know, come up up there to our table whereby we have more variety of them. And um, that is all for me. Thank you very much. Thank you, girls. Can I have you come out? But in a way, that we did. Can you go up there, please? And make yourself ready for baby Couture. Oui. Oh, on va les applaudir. Elles vont rejoindre Bibi Couture ce soir. Moko Moko Bioko. Amazing. You know what? No. I'm so proud of myself tonight. 
Why? Because at the moment, Congo is on top. Follow me. Let's go to our top model, international model. Oh, she's Uncle making Tom. us proud of everywhere. Wow. She just came back from the US. She's an ambassador. She's a charity worker. She, she does so much for the Congo. I could say she does so much for Africa. Passion for Maryland. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Are you having a good time? Yes. Well, great. My name is Lizette Nibo. As Bibish said, I'm from the Congo. I came in here, I was 14. I did all my studies and I've been modeling for five years. And three years ago, I, I and a team, we launched uh, Passion for Maryland, which is a, a, an organization working to empower homeless street children in Kinshasa. Um, yeah, so maybe she's a very, she's a good friend. I've known her for many years, and, and just well done for this great um, platform where you bring people together to celebrate African fashion. I mean, fashion is something that is so powerful because with fashion you can express yourself. With fashion you can show your identity, where you come from. You can promote yourself, basically. Thank fashion you. is as strong and as powerful as the media. So well done for this platform, and enjoy yourself, guys. Thank you, Lizzie. <laughs> well, uh, Thank you. It's not actually my creation. Is a song called You Raised Me Up. We talk about our roots today, we talk about tradition, and it's too deep. Uh, we all know we have to go back home and get what belongs to us. Uh, this song is more to praise the Lord because He raises us up all the time to reach the levels we can't reach whenever we feel, you know, uh, low or whatever. <laughs> Well, I'm very happy to have all of you here today. 
uh, we have been running this uh, project since three years. Uh, our aim is to to promote the African culture through the traditional dress code. So that's why we try to have like uh, Africa, the whole Africa world here. So meaning that for me, this is how our continent should be. One people, one culture, one love. So I'm very happy to have all of you here. We have people from Nigeria, from Congo. We have people who travel from uh, France, from Belgium to be here. We have people from the Central Republic. And we are making our way. Africans as well. Uh, yeah, of course, of course, of course. Nigeria, Ghana, uh, Zimbabwe, Kenya. So, Tanzania over there, Fashion House. Africa is here today, just to say that. So, it's a, it's a very long way. It's a very, very long way. So, we know that with your help, we're going to be there. We're going to be there. And uh, I can tell you, we are very happy to have all of, all of you here today. So next year, we're going to go again for it. And I'm sure with you, we're going to be there. So uh, who else better would, would like to help, would like to give a hand, who would like to help us into this project? You are invited. Come, we're going to sit, we're going to talk, and then we're going to make this much, much, much better. So I'm going to pass on the microphone to uh, Bibich, who's going to introduce uh, the a, a nightclub, so just a surprise. But before I finish, I will say thank you to all of you guys. There are uh, many people, some people who have been working very hard in the background. I will say special thank you. We have uh, Bibish Kiara who is there. Uh, we have uh, uh, Theodora the Queen who is there. They have been working very hard for us. Uh, Bridget is also there and uh, other people, I won't be calling their name today, but I'm happy. Uh, for all of you, thank you again, and uh, uh, Viva Africa for very, very, very long. Thank you. Very much. Thank you, Liz. I want to introduce someone very special. Someone that's been working very, very hard to promote African fashion. Someone that's been in the industry for maybe four, ten years. He's an icon. It is not old. He's a young person, but he's been doing it for so long. And he once was Mr. Ghana. 2013. So, can I have you round of applause, please, for Mr. G. Seppe, Mr. Ghana, 2013. Seppe, go ahead. First of all, thank you. All the models you've seen today was given to us by this mentor. He's the mentor of Mr. and Mrs. Black Beauty. So he's the mentor. He's the one that helps out. He deals with the model. He has an agency for models. He's the one that gave all of us to us. So, I'm going to introduce you with Lizette Mebo over there. She's got something next week. So, just in case she needs people, she knows where to go. Giuseppe, what do you have to say for us? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, God bless us for all invitation. You look so beautiful. I'm someone that I work, work so hard. And I thank God that, you know, I achieved my dreams since 10 years. That Everything is possible with God. I'm someone that you know I couldn't believe dreams. And I'm someone that you know I try to give up many steps. I'm someone that you know I've met different, different people in the world that you know they try to pull it down. But thank God that both these 10 years in the fashion industry have changed my life. And it means a lot for me because I have a power to inspire people, to be a role model for someone else. And I thank God that you know I believe in God that I'm gonna be the next top, top model in the, in the history of the fashion. So Anyway, I would like to thank all the team to support me, even you as well, for like to celebrate the 10 years because it's not easy, like you know. But anyway, God bless everyone, so I hope you enjoy it. God bless you. I want to mix Nigeria and Ghana together. So I'm going to call the one and only, the Queen. But the only thing is, there is no I in her, it's always a we. So I'm going to call Queen now. Theodora, I am the chief. Queen, I'm going to end you to introduce the 10 year certificate and the trophy to this lovely young man. We don't even know it. Congratulations. I've known him for a while. <laughs> and I always see his work. 
It's everywhere. Every beauty pageant I've seen him, every fashion show I've seen him. So he's really, really has worked hard. Congratulations. First of all, I want to say that I, want to, I don't want to say I want to be proud of myself, but I want to dedicate this award for all of you because without you, I couldn't make it. So I'll try my best to be on top and God bless you. Thank you. Apprécier le style et le talent africain. Et ce soir, on va prendre la prochaine, s'il vous plaît. Elle s'appelle Dimitri. Lorraine. Lorraine. She is from Jamaica. She is 25 years old. Wow. Take the benefit. She's not all about the beauty, she's all about the brain. Yeah. 
Yeah. 
someone that's come all the way, when we introduced the third edition, yeah. he said yes, I'm going to support you guys, and yes, I'll come all the way from Central Africa to come and support you guys. Yeah. So, I'm going to call upon La Deesse Nicole Bertil. Central Africa, sorry about that. She's from Congo. Which country is that? Central Africa? La République Centrafricaine. Okay. C'est un diplôme, un award. Merci. Ça fait plaisir. Voilà. Merci, grand frère. It's just something we to say on behalf of Moose Media and the team. We'd like to say thank you to every one of you. Thank you to everyone that come, that came from around the world to show us some support. And a huge, massive thank you to Pretty Restaurant. She's been the rock behind us. She didn't leave anything. Wow. She's been there. So thank you for everybody. Wow. I, I, I can just tell you this. See you next year, but in the park. Okay. On vous retrouve l'année prochaine Everybody love it.